That is what millions may be doing come April 8th when the total eclipse is set to darken the sky, many gearing up already. The total eclipse a result of the moon passing between our Earth and the sun. This celestial event happening in the sky, but it has plenty here on Earth, excited. We've got tickets sold from Germany, from Canada, uh, so people are taking it seriously. The Dallas Zoo is one of the lucky locations in the path of totality, meaning they could get complete darkness for about four minutes. They're planning for the event, giving away free eclipse glasses with ticket purchases. The staff is also looking forward to how the animals may react. We know um, birds often are talked about in terms of going quiet during an eclipse. The flamingos might be one of those areas where they would sort of gather around and protect some of the young. And then our primates and elephants, some of those really intelligent and intuitive animals, maybe something where they notice something's going on. While viewing the eclipse, remember to protect your eyes. And for your four-legged friends, you might just want to keep them indoors. Looking directly at the sun's visible surface for you know under a minute can cause some, some really serious damage to your eyes. One of the most affordable and, and, and simplest ways of observing the eclipse is by using a pair of eclipse shades. These are made of special materials that block out well over 99% of the sun's light. Walmart even selling an eclipse bundle package, so you can pick and choose what you might need for this special event, including not only the shades, but a cooler, a folding chair, and even a candy bar. <laughs> There's much more information about the eclipse on our website. And remember, we are inviting you to watch the eclipse with us. WFAA is partnering with the Perot Museum to host a watch party on April 8th.